okay you guys welcome back to my channel um this light in this room kind of sucks so i tried to adjust it as much as i can um i just came back from the store and i got some got to be glue to um spray these down and i got my makeups in here and i got some lashes um and i don't even think i got my lip gloss Y'all think I got my lip gloss, but basically I'm just getting ready um, to take Instagram pictures um, because I'm in the process of growing my social media platform. And I was just like, Salia, how do you expect to grow if you don't put in the effort to grow, if that makes sense? So I was like, you know what? No excuses, no more done with the excuses and why i'm not posting these eyebrows looking good today y'all but um update on my life and where i've been because this corona stuff my face has been breaking out really really bad like all right here right here and right here and i don't get breakouts like that like i don't get breakouts like that and these hair is bothering me but I don't get breakouts like that. So, um, I went to a dermatologist because y'all know I, like I said, my face don't break out unless I get like a period bump or something like that. But other than that, my face don't break out like that. You know what I'm saying? Like my face, my skin is pretty, pretty, pretty decent or whatever. So when my skin started breaking out, I noticed it like after it was too late, basically because I had already had all these spots and I wasn't paying attention. Like I was like, maybe um, it'll go away. But no, it was just getting worse. So I just went on vacation and I feel like it got worse because of the heat and the different, um, the different weather, basically. And so, you know, you have to wear a mask everywhere you go because of COVID. So it's like wearing a mask is like, breaking my skin out because I have oily skin. So it's like wearing this mask is not helping me. So it's just, it's irritating. But basically like y'all, like a little update. I just, a lot of stuff been going on in my personal life. And you know, sometimes you just have to take it as it is and just say, if it, like, honestly, that's my honest opinion. And I'm not going to speak into detail. I'm not going to go into specific facts about the topic or what happened. But just know, I'm just not about to entertain any type of negativity or none of that. Because I'm just like, no. So, like I said, I'm in the process of trying to grow my YouTube and my Instagram. Because, um, yeah, let me tell y'all what products I'm using. I ain't even telling y'all. So I'm using, I used the, for my eyebrows, I used Anastasia Brow Wiz and Ebony. And then for the concealer, I used the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer and Medium Slash Dark, so in Caramel. So if it focuses, it's probably not going to focus, but that's what I use. And then I'm going to put this on my face. This Neutrogena, this Neutrogena Hydro Boost Water Gel. Um, basically as a primer for my makeup. I like the way this feels on my skin more. Because I don't feel like my skin is... It just holds the makeup better if that kind of makes sense. So, you can get this from Ulta, um, Sephora pretty much anywhere so i know it's gonna rub it in um but yeah and i'm just like i want to change a lot of stuff like grow my social media and i have been working out so i'm gonna probably do like an update video on stuff like that and i set my eyebrows with the revolution luxury baking powder if y'all was wondering so for foundation i'm gonna go in with the nars it's nars again the nars radiant you know i didn't even know that i had both nars products that's crazy because i didn't buy this 
And I didn't even realize that I told that person to get ours. But this is in Marquise. Marquise's. I don't know how you say that. But basically, this is it right here. Um, so you just they said shake it up and then I apply it on this foundation brush. I used to use a beauty blender, but I realized beauty blenders really don't like blend your face that well. So I seen this trick on TikTok where if you set your face first with baking powder, that it stay your makeup stays longer. And my friend in Atlanta, she had did my makeup one day. And she had set my face first. And I was like, what the hell is she doing? And y'all, I'm talking about it worked. Like, literally, it like it's like a base for your makeup. So, she just like set my whole face. So, that's what I'm finna do. I'm just trying new stuff. I'm not a makeup artist or nothing like that. So, don't sit here and be like, she don't know what she's doing. Because I obviously don't. But I'm just doing what I feel like will work for me so i gotta fix that hair part but one thing i do like about this foundation is that it is full coverage um so i just take a little bit and just like dab it on my face and just like blend it in so at first i wasn't doing like full coverage makeup because i really didn't didn't need it but since my skin is breaking out your girl needs it. So, and you see it covers my dark spots and stuff. So, um, I'm probably going to keep my eyebrows on and my lashes. But I'm definitely taking this foundation off. Um, so, just go around your face and just kind of, you know, really, really... blend it in um but yeah i just i just like you know i say so many t every year like oh i'm gonna do this i'm gonna do that you see how i cleared that up yes ma'am but i'm like i'm gonna do this i'm gonna do that and then every year comes and y'all make sure you blend in it but every year comes and i'm in the same predicament i'm in from the previous year and I just be like, no, like, we not finna, we not finna do that. We not finna keep on not following our dreams and goals. Because the lifestyle I want to live is out there. And I can live it and I can do exactly what I want to do. Like, those of you know I'm in school. I got back in school, so... Um, yes, I'm in school and working and all this stuff. And at first I used to be like, oh, I don't have time. I don't have time to post YouTube videos. I don't have time to take pictures, but I do have time. Like I ordered me this little Bluetooth thing off Amazon because nobody really wanted to take my pictures. And um sometimes people can take good pictures of me and sometimes they can't um and i really wasn't liking the way that some people some people take my pictures it's like the angles wasn't looking right i wasn't looking right in the picture or something like that so i was just like no so what i started doing was i was like looking on youtube on how to take your own pictures and how I take my pictures and how I edit my pictures and stuff like this. Like, you know, to get the best lighting and to bring out your clothes and stuff like that. So, I don't put this stuff everywhere on my face. For some reason, the way my skin is set up, if I put a lot of, um, if I put a lot of uh, concealer on and stuff and then I take my pictures it just don't look right, y'all. It just... And I know it's not the right brush to use, but I don't care. Like, I don't care. And I don't have... If I have a beauty blender, I don't know where it is. And I'm not going to look for it because... Who? 
I don't know, this makeup looking a little funky, but it's okay because, you know, this is just for the gram. And whatever is left, I just kind of add to my eyes. I really think it's just this lighting, though. Like, it's just kind of washing me out. But y'all get the picture. I'm not about to sit here in front. Like, I don't have acne marks. And I'm not going to sit here and, like, edit this video to where making my skin look brighter. Because this is how I look. You know what I'm saying? So, no, we're not going to do that. But contour let me get my contour palette um so i use the morphe contour palette and let me get my brushes let's see what brush we're gonna use today i don't feel like taking all this stuff out so that's kind of why i'm like reaching over here i know that's not professional but um yeah i'm sorry we're gonna use this brush i don't even know this is a contour brush it's actually a highlighting brush, but I like it because the way it's made. So I'm going with this fabulous. My bad, somebody was calling me, but people be selling these lashes from AliExpress and stuff. And y'all, this is a perfect fit. Like it's not too. Hmm. But they be selling these lashes and stuff from AliExpress. Let me put y'all on, and they be like two dollars. For them lashes. But what you paying for is like shipping. And they, these lashes, they take forever to come. And they charging y'all $10. Uh, 10 to $15 for a pack of lashes. Let me put this stuff in the trash. It's a little bag. Um, when you can literally get the same lashes. You know what I'm saying? Like... So don't let these people fool y'all into, and this is like super stronghold eyelash adhesive in black so that this don't come off because don't nobody got time for their lashes to be coming off. So, but that's what they do. They, um, they get them off AliExpress and they sell them. That's what they do, they sell them. I'm kind of quiet, but I'm trying to concentrate because who? And I gotta find my lip gloss because I don't know where that's at. I thought I had left it in the car, but when I went in the car today to go get some guys to be glue to put down this frontal, yeah, I didn't see it in there. So let's pray that it's in this house somewhere. So let's see if this will match this eye. It does, but it's a little too long. So we're gonna kind of cut this one a little bit. And I'll be right back. Okay, you guys, update on the makeup. Let me open this blind up. So um, I finished doing my foundation, um, putting these lashes on, and I just did my hair. You can kind of see it kind of looks a little bit better with the sunlight. Um, I got my little Christmas tree right here, so. I don't know if well, I'm going to take my pictures at, but I need to clean my couch off. Excuse that. But this is the makeup in the sun. If you can see. My brows on point. Lashes on fleek. So. Let me move this stuff. For work later on. Excuse me. But, um. But, yeah. So, I'm trying to see. Where I'm gonna take my pictures at, um, and stuff. So right now I gotta find an outfit to put on. I'm sorry, not modeling the camera like this, but I gotta find an outfit to put on, you guys, so I can take my picture. Um, I'm trying to kind of clean up a little bit because I got stuff everywhere. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all because I do got clothes everywhere. So, we're just gonna throw it right there. And then pick. 
pick up these clothes because y'all when i get off work i'd be tired like i'd be tired so your girl don't really be having time to clean up clean up like that but you know how it be when you get off work and you tired so um put this stuff up off the couch get this comb This up, this up. This is trash. So, um, yes, I'm in the process of. Well, you can kind of see I kind of cleaned my couch off a little bit. So my living room is pretty basic, y'all. But you gotta do what you gotta do. When you are your own boss and you ain't got no man, you gotta improvise. Cause I don't need no man. I don't. I'm fine just by myself. Okay, you guys, so this is the final result. My hair is kind of a little bit late. I have to do this a little bit more to use the dirty mirror, but we got this little track jumpsuit on. Excuse the sink. But yes, so we finna take our pictures and I'm gonna insert the pictures in here. When I'm done, if you guys wanna see more videos like this, how I take my Instagram pictures, let me know down below in the comments and get your girls to 2K on instagram and youtube and i will be back my next video bye bye